Okay, in the last video I showed you this ball, and I actually never got to showing you the complete product. So, this is what it looks like, and it actually rolls fairly well. So, it's a full-on sphere. The complete I have, though, is that, this area right here. There's a big chunk left out. So, if there was, like, a beam right here, like, one of those ro uh, rods, then that, that would work. But I don't know how to put that on, actually. Okay. So, now we're doing this. Comment down below if you know what it is. Okay. I'll show you the pieces. Okay. So here's the pieces. You need eight of these. You need eight of these um, one by two tiles. You need two of these longer um, technique pieces. One of these half um, plus and half technic. One of these technic and plus um, rod holes. So you need one of those. Four of these plus rod nuts. Two of these double technic one by two bricks. Two of these tech six one by six technic pieces and that is it. So first you're gonna do, gonna do put these and these together with these. Okay. So you're going to take this put the, you put the, um, mm, you put the Technic short part in this so that it goes all the way over here, and then you take these two things, and then you put this hole on this, and slide it all the way over, and then the same for that side. Okay, that might have sounded very confusing, but you just basically put this hole on the Technic, this hole in the Technic, slide it down, and then put the last other piece on it. And that's what it looks like. So turn it over, then you have all your Lego piece uh, studs. Then, then you're gonna tile it. You're gonna put the tiles on the top with these tiles. Okay, so you have this all tiled up, and this is the pattern you want. So you want a tan piece and a silver piece, one in the middle, one on the end, and these are just on the longer pieces. These are just the regular tile that you chose. Okay, so then you're going to want to take this piece. white piece and you're gonna put it in okay so you have your piece and then this is in here that requires taking off one of the rods and pushing that in and then put that piece over it okay and now you're gonna take this piece the rod that you chose it's gonna be more like a pig Okay, then you're gonna put. Okay, you're gonna put this in that hole, the Technic hole. Okay, now you have this in there. Okay, then you're gonna put the nuts on it. 
one on the bottom first so that it doesn't fall, and then one on the top, and then continue that. Okay, now it's done. Because you have this. Now it's time to reveal what this is. If you already know what that is, it's a fidget spinner. A fidget spinner is a basically... Here, I'll show you. like a pencil in your, in your classroom and you just want to do this. That is a fidget. This is for um, you spin it and it's supposed to help you focus more. And if you fidget in class with this, it's supposed to help you focus more on your work, and averagely, people who fidget more, they're a little bit more successful. I don't know if that makes sense, but um, that, that's basically what this is meant for. It's, make, it's meant for you to focus. So, um, it's a fidget spinner. And if you know what this is, you, like... Take your finger and your thumb, and you spin it with your middle finger. Just spin it. Okay. I'll teach you a trick with this. You spin it, and you can try to get it to spin on your middle finger or your thumb. It's kind of hard to do with a camera in your hand. So, um, on the camera. Okay, um, my sister's came in to know. Um, okay, you spin it, and you can try to spin it on your middle finger, or your thumb. It, it's kind of hard to do with a Lego fidget spinner, but it still works. Oh, and my sister's right there. So yeah. Hi. Okay. Bye, see you next video. Make sure to subscribe. Subscribe. And leave a like. Bye bye, bye bye, bye bye.